Tinea solium is a pork tapeworm that infects humans. Humans become infected after eating contaminated pork or through fecal-oral exposure. Larvae from the tapeworm eggs migrate to muscle and other tissues, including the brain, which can lead to neurocystosarcosis, a major cause of seizures in developing countries. Can the transmission of tinea be stopped on a population-wide level? Investigators implemented a three-phase eradication program to eliminate tinea solium from the villages of Tumbes province in Peru. Various screening and treatment strategies of both pigs and humans were conducted in the first two phases of the program to determine the most effective and practical interventions to implement on a wider scale. In phase three, over a one-year period, mass treatment was given to over 81,000 people in 107 villages, and more than 55,000 pigs received treatment and vaccination. Humans received a series of three doses of niclosamide, with 85% of the entire population receiving at least one dose during the intervention period. Pigs received oxfendazole every two months, along with tinea vaccinations. At baseline, the prevalence of pigs with tinea seropositivity ranged from 25 to 50 percent. After 12 months of intervention, 3,530 pigs were randomly screened, and 29 percent were seropositive for antibodies. Necropsies were conducted on 342 seropositive pigs, and less than 1 percent were found to have live, non-degenerated cysts as compared with an estimated prevalence of at least 20% before the intervention. Thus, tinea solium transmission can be stopped on a population-wide level with mass treatments of both pigs and humans, along with pig vaccination. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.